And now we let uh, we put our monkfish here. Uh, we have a monkfish. It comes only in tails. You see, uh, we would be, the head would be attached about this size here. It's quite big. The tail goes up to here, so it's quite a big fish. Can you imagine, right? Okay, monkfish is a cartilaginous fish, and you can see it here. The spine is very soft. It's only cartilage. It yields two round fillets. And all we do, what we have to do now is to cut fillet off on top of the spine. We cut the fillet off here. And do the same on the other side. And here we have a cartilage which is quite soft. It breaks very easily. Snaps. Next, we have to remove this skin here, There's some skin and connective tissue on the other side. So we want to remove this. Okay, so we lay down the fish on the skinny side and slowly cut it off. Then we turn it over and we remove the rest skin by picking down lifting up like a silver skin, remove it carefully if there is any bloodline we want to remove this as well this monkfish has a nice white meat that's what we want to showcase Next, we wrap the monkfish fillet in bacon. We have three slices per fillet. So lay them out a little bit diagonally. That's about right. Okay, we season the fish with black pepper and a little bit of salt. Don't use too much salt because the bacon is salty already. Then we roll it up the bacon, so we lap it, overlap it first, okay, turn it over it with a wooden skewer, just from one side, so I cannot open and unroll. So we have a frying pan, it's quite hot. You can see, we sear off the monkey fillet from all sides very, very quickly. And then we will finish them in the oven. Take it in a few minutes to be nice and juicy still inside. And the bacon should be nicely colored and brown. Okay, the monkfish is done now, so we have to let it rest a little bit, and for this occasion, we will sprinkle some chopped tarragon and chopped chive on top, and we roll it to coat it completely with the chopped herbs, and let it rest or sit for at least, let's say, five minutes at a warm place. For a plate up, we have everything ready here now. The monkfish is uh, rested. We have a risotto ready, the carp coulis, the vinaigrette with the seedlings. Everything is hot, everything comes together. The plate is here already hot. So now, what we do, we remove the skewer from monkfish. And then we slice it slightly on a bias, not too thick. We call this medallions. The monkfish should be very juicy. And when you can see it here, 
has a nice texture to it. It's called the poor man's lobster. 